Today we're going to be making a bad word filter and we're going to be using this library called bad words. It's pretty simple, but I do want to go over some of the details because by default, this filter here doesn't have enough bad words, I think. So I have made a little list. Well, I have made the list. This person here has made the list and I've just converted it to JSON so we can import it in our program. But let me explain quickly how this works. So the first thing you do is that you require in bad dash words and then you name it filter. Then you make a new instance of that and then you will get this filter here. Now you can often have multiple filters so you can have a different bad word filters. By default it comes with some values but there is a way of removing words. I won't go in like great details because your use case might be very different from mine. This here is completely optional. These two lines here, it's just the extra words. And the extra words is are all of these words here. Giant list of bad words. And remember that you can't just put an array directly in here. You do have to spread it. So this is using the spread syntax to spread it out because the way this add words function wants its values is like this. So word like that, like that, and it doesn't want an array. So it wants them like this, so like strings, and then that's essentially what those three dots here does. Just takes the array and makes them parameters. After that, this is to completely optional. This is actually just for testing. I'm just testing them. I'm just doing filter.clean, and this will clean this sentence here. So let's try running this code here. So let me get my console, and let's try running it. And you can see that the words are pretty good blurred out. Now, I would recommend testing this a lot because you can see this word here is not flagged. And the way you would go about like adding a word, if it's just a single word, you can actually just do this here. Just delete all of this and just add it like that. And then you would add your word. And if we add this word here and we run it again, you can see that it's now blocked. So if you just want to add a single word, and like I said before, if you want to add multiple, just do like this and just continue doing this. So if you like this video, hit the thumbs up button and the subscribe button. If you want to see more of my videos, I have included two videos right here. And hopefully I see you in the next one.